my parents are squatting in an abandoned building on the Lower East Side. Do you honestly tell me that you're happy right now? Yes, I am. I was really lucky because in the audition process, uh, part of it was auditioning with Brie, and we did the majority of our scenes uh, from the movie in the audition, and really had like kind of an extensive work session on it. Um, so I think you know when you're in it and you're doing it, you find so much of it in the moment. Um, so we did that, and I was like, okay, wow, we have a really good base. I hope I get this job. And then once the once I had gotten offered the the part and and the movie started, and then you know the preparation started, it was just talking to Destin and seeing what he wanted to do. So I was just sort of like listening to Destin and seeing which way he wanted to take it, and you know he sort of to some degree shapes the story, David, um, or their relationship. Pack yourself a favorite flower. You gonna tell him about us? We shouldn't be ashamed of us just because we choose a different lifestyle than you. When did you lose your sense of adventure? A good director is somebody who really has control over the whole set. Um, and it's easy to lose control of a set. And Destin has it from the moment he walks on in a way that is so loving and respectful and open and um, available. And it creates an environment for everybody, no matter what department you're in, to really express themselves within this film and, and like really be an artist. And that's what you want to do. And then the next thing you know, you're like, I feel like I'm doing really scary work right now. I've never gone like this. <laughs> you know what I mean? And like, you know, Brie, who's used to it, has worked with me before, um, you know, you would see them communicate and it was like, it was, it, was really, it was really cool to watch. It felt like, you know, in some jobs you show up and you're just there to be a part of it. And in this one, it was, you felt really lucky to be a part of it and you were like learning things as it was going on and you were watching like, really, really talented people work. I told you so. You ain't like me. I am like you, and I'm glad.